hi guys welcome to my channel in this video i will be teaching you how to do a voiceover in your editing app example we will be using the InShot app and also how to edit it how to look for clips maybe you did your voiceover on the phone just like the way i taught you in the first tutorial and you want to import it into the InShot app so this video is the complete guide about all those things i listed how to edit your voiceover one how to import your voiceover to and also how to do a voiceover in the editing software itself so those are three things we will be talking about make sure you watch to the end so you will be able to understand everything better now let's begin so i have here with me my InShot app i don't know if you can see it okay my InShot app is open so i'll be going to video now i'll be clicking on new as you can see i'll click on new so i'll be selecting the video i recorded let's say i want to do a voiceover on the video so i'll be selecting it and bringing it in so if you want to know how to edit your video i already have video tutorial about that so you can check that out but because we are talking about recording with an editing software like a voiceover with an editing software so i will be going to my music so i have the track i don't know if you can see track i have the effect and i have record so i'll be clicking on the record as i said earlier now i click on record it's already recording now i'm lying down so because i'm lying down, it's more easier for me to do my voice record and also be able to do it right and i have clothes as you can see pillow blanket like that curtains around me so it's i'm in front of a window but the window is partially closed as you can see it's closed the other side is open so it will be easier for me to do my voice record and i won't be doing it direct to my mouth i'll bring in the phone a little bit down so let's see the difference between the one we did earlier and how it will sound like in the voice and um, editing software app so I'll click on record. Now let's start. Hi people, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will be teaching you how to do a voiceover using your phone with this editing software. So I hope you guys enjoy this series with me. Please don't mind the lighting and everything about this video. Just enjoy this video and learn something from it, guys. So now I've paused it. So let's listen to it. Let's see how it sounds. Hi people. So in today's video, I will be teaching you how to do a voiceover using your phone with this editing software. Okay, so the video I'm playing also have a voice. So let me load that. I've load, load it. So now let's listen to me. Please don't mind the lighting and everything about this video. Just enjoy this video and learn something from me guys so so you can see that's how to do your voiceover even on your editing software just make sure you're around something like clothes pillow and you're facing um lying down like this and the phone is not directly into your mouth instead is below your mouth and you are talking to your phone so it's only doing boom so the air you bring out from your mouth from your nose while talking won't be going directly into the microphone and it will be sounding awful in the ears of your listeners. So I hope these tips were helpful. Tell me your thoughts about it in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. First thing first, you open your InShot app, then now we'll go to the new section. So we'll be selecting the video clip we did earlier. So we'll be bringing it in so we can place a video, a voiceover over it. So now i have a video clip i want to put my voice over and i can also record just like i taught you from the beginning of this tutorial how to do your voice record on the editing software but now i want to import like an already made voice over just like the way i taught you in the first tutorial how to do an already made voice over using your sound recorder app so now i will be searching for the voice over i did in my previous videos i will be importing it to show you guys how to edit it on this app 
so i will be looking for where it is kept till i see it then i will be showing two different ways on how to search for it depending on where it was transferred from and now if i see the voice record sometimes it might not want to play in the editing software itself like it might not want to come in so i will be showing you another method of extracting the voice over from it like how to extract it from your video so like this now i picked any video and um, voice voice sound so that's the voice record i did you can see it's called the new record but it's not clickable can you see the difference between it and other file it's not clickable maybe because i transferred it from my other phone to this phone through zender so it's not clickable now the only option i have is to teach you guys how to extract your voice over from the video itself so when you extract it from the editing app then you are good to go to just edit the voice record and place them where necessary so that's what we'll be doing next so now i'm back to the app of the recorder and now we're clicking on track so you can see that icon of the extract audio from video so that's what i'll be clicking on then i will be clicking on extract audio so it's in two ways you can extract it from the already video you have in your app why you can just go back to the video itself and extract the audio from it just like the way i'm doing so you will extract it then you click on this tick sign and click on ok so then you are good to go with the extracted audio but i do advise to play it and listen to it to know the exact place and point the recorded voiceover is being played before you now import it to the editing software so i'll be clicking on ok now then the video will be imported into the base area of the software app so now we now have it at the safe area and it will play it so i can listen to the voice and know where and exactly where to edit so i will be offering the main video but while i do this i will be the only one to know the exact point I say if I will be playing it, then you guys will be listening to it. So, but anyways, this is just me showing you that while you are doing it, you just have to play it. Then you know there's that now, point where there is mistake. So, when you get to that point, you split. So after splitting, then you go back again and listen to where the beginning of the error was. Then you split again. That's all. You delete and so guys, continue listening again. So it will make the so voices plain it's and we clear without error. So that's how I do my voiceover for all my YouTube videos. So I hope this tip is helpful and I hope you are able to do something creative from this. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for coming. Till next time, stay safe and stay blessed don't forget to give your thoughts this and question girl, in the comment section i would love to hear from you all right guys okay. thank you so much so practice this and send in your question and for so more videos comment what you want to know about in the comment so section all right bye thank you for watching stay safe so afterwards, make sure you rewatch well, your that. video clip from the Hi beginning people. to the end and check if there are no more errors. Then Hi you people. arrange Welcome it all afterwards. That's saving your video and make sure software. it's so all done. So this is all I have for you guys on personal development with Kosara of the Fat I hope you learned something the good today. So next time, stay safe. Guys. Now, and stay blessed. So let's Bye. To so I'll be clicking also on save and then the highest quality one it I make sure I save in the highest quality sometimes. <laughs>